What's up guys? Today I came to chat with you about a very interesting and important test in the world of biomedicine, the anti-SSA-RO test, anti-SSA antibody research, RO. Let's dive into this universe and understand a little more about this test, what it's for, how it's done, and other really cool information. Let's go there. First of all, what does this strange acronym mean? Well, SSA-RO are proteins found in the nucleus of some cells. When our body identifies these proteins as enemies and starts producing against them, it could be a reflection of some autoimmune disease. And that's where the anti-SSA-RO exam comes in. It detects the presence of symptoms in our body. The anti-SSA-RO test is a very important test to aid in the diagnosis of various autoimmune diseases, such as systemic lupus erythematosus, SLE, s syndrome, and some connective tissue diseases. It is also important in the follow-up of pregnant women with a history of children who were born with congenital heart block. The good news is that you don't need to fast to take the anti-SSR URO action. That's right, you can have your breakfast in peace before going to the lab. Just remember to drink plenty of water, okay? Hydration is essential to facilitate blood collection. On the exam result, you will see something called a reference value. It serves as a kind of benchmark to understand whether the amount of meat in your blood is within the expected range or not. In the case of anti-SSA-RO, the reference value varies from laboratory to laboratory, but is normally below 10 u ml If your result is above this value, it's good to talk to your doctor to understand what is related, see? So that's it guys. The anti-SSA-RO exam is a super important test to help diagnose autoimmune diseases and monitor pregnant women with a history of children who were born with congenital heart block. And as you've seen, it's not a seven-headed animal. I hope I helped clarify a little more about this exam. And whenever you have questions, talk to your doctor, okay? After all, he is the most qualified professional to guide you in these cases. Hugs, and see you soon. Espero ter ajudado a esclarecer un paco my saber s exam. E. Semper quativum dubitas, conversum com su medico ta. A final, a let e o professional mais capacitado para orienter voces nesses casos. Abracos e eight approxima.